Well, uh, we've got a pretty wide range of activities. On the intramural side, we've done um, our flag football. We've got a floor hockey tournament coming up. Uh, we'll be doing a dodgeball tournament, uh, battleship in the pool at the end of October. Oh, a uh, three-on-three basketball tournament um, towards the end of November, early December, right before finals week. Um, from last year, I never really heard about anything that intramurals offered. And this year, um, it's kind of created a buzz. So our goal is to promote the intramural leagues so as much as we can to get more involvement on campus. I think it's really hard on campus when no one really knows about something, so no one wants to take the initiative to get involved. So now that uh, we kind of have a buzz on campus, people are really starting to come out to events and starting to participate in the um, things that we offer to do. I play roller hockey, club roller hockey. And they didn't really have a goalie last year, and so I decided to join, and then I stuck with it because I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed the guys on the team. Um, I enjoyed it. It's actually really close to my home, so my family was able to come watch me play. Okay, we play at Marple Sports Arena, which is located in Broomall, about 10 minutes south of campus. Um, we play like Temple, Villanova, uh, Drexel, just local schools in the area. Um, I like it because it's like a casual sport. It's not something to take too seriously. Um, good takeaways, you get to meet some new people, um, some people that you probably wouldn't meet outside on campus or anything like that. I'm in the club lacrosse program. Uh, I got involved, uh, well, I think looking back my freshman year, I wanted to, to do something um, aside from just going to the gym. I wanted to get involved back in a team sport. I'm, uh, some of the games too, uh, we, I remember we had our first game I was ever in, a great win against uh, Delaware Valley College where uh, Ian McGlynn scored the winning goal in overtime. That was, that was a really memorable game. Uh, there's a lot of benefits to intramurals and club sports. Um, the biggest is just that sense of community and just getting out and having fun outside of the classroom, you know, grabbing your friends, uh, maybe people in your, in your res hall, and getting together and making a team. Sometimes it could be a competitive team, other times it could be just for fun. The biggest benefit of playing is I've met new people. Um, Thing also, it's just you bond closer with some floor mates, uh, meet people from Valley Forge who come over and play with us since we're partnered with them. If they wanted to do a, a sport or a tournament for intramurals or for club for that matter, um, just come in and, and see me at the second floor of the Dixon Center or send me an email. Um, we can sit down and talk about whether that sport's going to take off, if we think there's going to be enough interest, kind of start to, to gauge the interest on campus and see what we can do and then kind of go from there.